guys, um, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> As you can probably tell, it's uh, it's pretty blurry. I believe that this is because I was filming in very, very low light. Um, you can't really, really tell, but um, my floor lamp in my kitchen, from my kitchen, from my living room, um, was actually the only source of light <laughs> while I was filming this. Um, yeah so clearly that didn't go too well i do have a video flipping through like a little 20 minute clip flipping through at the very end of this video um if you guys are curious and want to actually see what the spread looks like um but i just sped everything up a little bit faster than normal which is why this video is so short um again i apologize for that i will i will hopefully not film at 10 o'clock at night ever again um so <laughs> hopefully that problem will be fixed in the future and for the third time i apologize um but anyways i decided to do a washi tape kind of monthly if that makes sense like a washi tape theme instead of using pictures like i normally do and i actually really love how it turned out um i ended up using a like brownish gray, blue, mint kind of color scheme. Um, and I really like how all of that turned out. I ended up using a like dark gray for my lines instead of, um, instead of a black fine liner, which I think ended up looking really nice too. Um, overall, I just, I like how like simple it kind of looks. Like it looks like it would be easy to put together because it was. <laughs> But I kind of just like that it's not like 100% perfect and I don't know. It's just nice to look at, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. Um, but yeah, it was super easy to throw together. It took me about 40 minutes to do this entire thing. Um, so obviously I've, I've sped it up a lot. Um, <laughs> God, I'm so mad that all of this footage is blurry. Um, my hand is in focus for some reason. I don't entirely know why. Um, so it's not like that far off focus. I just can't figure out why I would have focused on my hands rather than my journal because I always focus it on my journal, but it doesn't matter. It's over at this point. Um, I made a little teeny tiny calendar that I want to use um, like skinny washi tape for to just mark off like trips and stuff like that, like events and things. Um, and then I ended up putting three sections in here. It says goals, a to-do list, and things to try. Um, and just kind of separated it with washi tape. I actually didn't plan that out at all to have those three sections. <laughs> um, but I was like, oh, that's how I can use the rest of this page. Um, so I put in four goals. Um, I'll probably have like four or five things to do. And then I put in five things to try. Um, which right now are just penny boarding and vegan cooking. So we'll see how either of those two things go. Because in June I was supposed to track all of my vegan cooking and didn't end up doing that. So that's really fun. <laughs> Anyways, um, just going around and I don't like that I went around my July like this. Um, I think it just didn't pop enough for me initially and I don't love that I did that honestly I really don't um if you do it neater than I did I think it looks nice but I didn't do it very neatly so um yeah <laughs> this is my habit tracker for the month um kept it pretty simple I don't know why I wanted to do it vertically but I did <laughs> um and I wanted to have fewer habits because last month, let's see how many I had because I had a lot. I had 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 habits. It's a lot of habits. Um, and I don't like habit tracking. As <laughs> we've seen in pretty much every video that I've ever made, I really hate habit tracking. So I don't know why I keep doing this to myself. Um, but I put in habits that I genuinely want to work on for this month, um, and two of them aren't even habits out of this spread, because the first block is for sleep, 
Um, and that'll be in hours, just using my watch app that I have been using for the last month-ish. Um, and then the last bar is mood, so I'll use that as like a bar graph of different mood levels for the month. So that'll be nice to have. Um, and then the rest of my habits are working out, doing Bible study, doing regular studying, which is basically just doing schoolwork, um, using the Forest app, uh, getting creative, practicing self-care, taking meds, and then just mood, which is which will just be out of, I guess, four, because that's how much space I left for myself. Um, and here is where things get kind of interesting, because I don't usually do weeklies, um, but for some reason, <laughs> this month I've decided to do that, and most of the reason why I am convincing myself that I did this was because um, I want to use my journal more as a journal as well as a, a planner. So I'm thinking that having weeklies to plan out my days every week will make getting creative on my daily pages a lot easier. Um, so all of these weeklies are all here together all five weeks of July and then after that I will just have absolute chaos pretty much. <laughs> um, I'll have to film a weekly plan with me. Um, for next week because I didn't end up doing any of these spreads just because I'm filming this so early. Um, <clears throat> like I'm not using my bullet journal again until Monday, which is like four days, five days from now. So I'm not going to set it up now. Um, but I will be definitely interested to see how this all goes because I want to do like legitimate dailies. Um, so like I don't know, just like running list spreads and like writing a little blurb about how my day was and all of that. Um, so I'm hoping that doing things this way makes that a little bit easier. Um, and I'm just adding some color to these pages because there wasn't enough room for washi tape. Um, but they were super simple too and I really like how they came out as well. Um, and I'm just adding in the week of and everything to these pages and all of that. Um, super boring Monday through Sunday because that's how my brain works even though every calendar that I've ever looked at is a Sunday start, which drives me absolutely crazy. Um, <clears throat> it's fine. I just have to deal with everybody else having Sunday starts, but my week and my brain starts on a Monday, so that's how I do everything. Um, just adding in little headers, and then I will start my... When I do come back on the 29th, not the 27th, like I wrote it in, I will... Um, like start in that little extra column. But here is the <laughs> clear flip view through flip through um, of my plan with me. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.